friends it is time to uh, really understand the uh, next type of uh, memory allocation stuff which is nothing but a realloc r alloc so realloc is the one that we need to really uh, see now what is realloc realloc is very simple i have allocated some memory with my m alloc r c alloc okay uh, i have discussed that very clearly in my previous video so it doesn't take much more time for us to really explain those thing again and it is not necessary m alloc will help you r c alloc will help you in allocating some memory and some memory spaces and c alloc would have helped you in initializing it with zero whereas m alloc would not have done that we have seen that in brief uh, uh, in the last session so i'm going to now give you a clear view of how real lock can be used assuming that i have allocated 5 bytes of memory with m lock or c lock now i feel that it is really not sufficient for me to uh, proceed with my operation so what do i need is i need to have some more memory allocated but it has to start from the same place it is just an extension of the existing memory or it is just an alteration of the existing memory stuff so what do i do is very simple i will use real lock i'll reallocate the memory which has been already allocated or which had been already allocated to a different size that's possible through real lock now let me give you a simple demo for this it's very simple uh, what do i do here i have two pointers here one is address pointer uh, i mean integer pointer another one is character pointer character pointer we'll see later don't worry about it first i am assigning memory through m lock three bytes of memory i am assigning for example i need three uh, memory spaces here and i'm just printing it now i need to reallocate it i need to make this 3 as 5 so how do i do it simple i'll use the same address i mean the same pointer has to be used rest things remain the same instead of m lock here i need to use real lock and what am i reallocating i am reallocating address which means uh, this is connected to the previously allocated stuff so i will start from the same place and i will extend it to 5 now earlier it was 3 now i am assigning it to 5 now i am freeing it after i have completed my work i am freeing it now this is just a small demo where i uh, have proven you that we can reallocate but it would really make sense when i go with the character example because you can see the uh, improvement literally so first i am trying to allocate memory for eight characters and then i uh, use string copy to copy i love india into this character pointer which means the literally the spaces are allocated now i am printing it now i really have only eight uh, memory spaces here i want to make it 12 so how do i do it i'll make it in the same way as i did earlier character pointer equal to i have used type casting here and then realloc char pointer earlier it was eight now i need to make it 12 so i'm making it 12 now i allocate or assign instead of i love in i love india so which is little bigger which needs little more space and then i print it that's it it is very 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 simple it is just used to reallocate the allocated memory but it can work only with the memory allocation uh, functions like m lock c lock remember it is used for dynamic memory allocation reallocation work we are allocating memory which are already allocated through dynamic memory allocation methods like m lock and b m lock and c lock realloc is used to reallocate the memory that's it it's very simple i am going to show you the demo right now we'll see how good it comes it takes a uh, few seconds as usual um, because of many uh, software being installed in my machine it's overloaded now we will get couple of warnings let's not worry about it much now now yeah we got it initial memory allocation is here address memory reallocation you can see that both are the same now with the character stream string initial memory allocation is here i reallocate i have assigned i love ind now i love india is here that's it it's very simple i hope you guys uh, uh, understood what i wanted to convey and it's pretty easy for you guys to go through also so please give a try in your machine i use dev c++ um, it's pretty easier to uh, use and to understand thank you very much for following my channel i'll get back to you with more inputs if you have any comments please do type and please subscribe if you like thank you